totally out of it and probably in great pain, great discomfort. When later I was told that I was not a candidate, I was very grateful. Another healing. I'm not in any pain or discomfort at all, which astonishes the hospital. I'm in a great mood continuously. But most important, I've been able to control everything. Getting the ministry ready, selling homes that sadly included our Hope Hill Retreat Center that would have gone into instant years-long probate because of Georgia and Texas laws. My website, positivechristianity.org, will continue forever as a legacy under a trust, as a continuing resource of written prayers, sermon archives, three television channels, positive daily inspiration archives, and daily prayers, and seminars all free of charge. Our success has always been our copyright. You have the right to copy anything, anytime. Our inspiration is directly from God and God shares everything freely. One of my mother's favorite quotes was, Do not cry because it's over. Smile because it happened. We are so much more than flesh and bones. Three words sum up my life. It goes on. My grave at Leak Cemetery in Mason, Michigan, just south of Lansing, will be a place that you can visit, but I'm not there. My soul has lifted out of this body that can no longer serve its full aliveness. My thoughts as my life in this body ends. My friend, I don't want to live just being a spectator. I want to be a full participant, which this body can no longer do. But I can from the other side. If God can take an ordinary man like me, and in time sometimes a bumbling idiot, and make something extraordinary. Imagine what God can do with you. What do I want to be remembered for? How do I want to give back? My legacy has to be what I leave behind, not what I take with me. In people of all religions around the world or none, were they and you in turn, will make a difference in someone else's life. I pray that you find happiness, my friend, overflowing and uncontained every day of your life. I saw a woman at a traffic light the other night. She was bouncing around and singing at the top of her lungs, and her joy made me joyful and laugh out loud. Looking back on my life, this defines my life. It was so good and so happy that I pray that it was never just contained within me. But perhaps that happiness overflowed to others to you. My friend, thank you for making my life better, and God bless you. Now, if you're close to Lansing, Michigan, you are invited to attend my services in person, or later by live stream, or at your convenience by the video link that will be on the Funeral Homes website for a long time to come. This will be a Saturday funeral service midday. 
It will be led by my great personal friend for many decades, Reverend Ron Scott, the Minister of Spiritual Life Center of Troy, Michigan. The services will take place at Estes Letty Funeral Home, located in Lansing, Michigan. Their telephone number is 517-482-1651. Their website, www.estesledley.com. The date and time of the funeral, Eastern Time, will be on the funeral website and available by phone by calling the funeral home. Again, thank you for making my life that much better. God bless you.